and welcome back to another episode of your last Raven I seen the video. Now today we have this comment here. So the name Bird's Eye, something I always like is people making ACs named after birds or whatever, like themed after birds. Because, you know, that's what we are. We're ravens in the game. Like, okay, okay, fourth generation we were lynx, but like every other generation we were ravens. So it's very fitting to make something bird themed. But okay, 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 let us just quickly make our AC. So here we have the AC bird's eye and uh, it's again a tank use the shade 2 and m2 uh, uh, Gatling gun now about that one you wrote mh or something like that like <laughs> Clearly that was kind of wrong, but you did mention machine gun So it wasn't that hard to find out what the hell you were talking about triple missile launcher along with the laser uh, Cannon on the back and some extensions and of course some hangar units But I don't really think that's gonna be too important, but okay Let's just quickly go to the test AC for uh, the test arena first <sighs> Okay, let's just quickly go and test this out. So clearly it is a tank, so I'm not too mobile. I do have the Shade 2 along with the machine gun here. Now the uh, goal of that is to stay close with that machine gun. However, we do have the missile launcher, which I can't exactly use here. Uh, eh? Like, I only get 310 kilometers per hour, that's nothing. Uh, and here's the laser cannon. I think I need to focus on that first. Like. You know, yeah, I'll start with that, and if I have, if the enemy happens to get close, then I'll switch over to my laser rifle and can use this. And if then, like, I don't know, no, 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 wait, wait, triple missile launcher comes first as well. Oh, uh, okay. You know what? I'll just have to see what the hell happens. I'm just gonna go to the test AC and see how well I can uh, perform with this. Okay, here we go. I want to try start with the missiles at first. So here, let's just start with some missiles. So uh, three missile uh, missiles per lock on, along with whatever the extension shoots. Uh, but however, he's staying a bit too close. So you know what? Here, uh, oh, of course, you uh, I lose lo the lock on on you like the moment I got a full lock on. There we go, another hit. And well, let me just whittle you down a bit. Like uh, he's trying to stay far away. Okay, now I can go back to my triple missiles. There we go. Because now that I got the the range, he can't exactly dodge it that easily anymore. There we go. Some more of that. And come on, some more, some more. There, and you know, let's go with our normal shade too as well and use our machine gun. So there we go. Oh, he's almost down, but uh, hang on. Come on, there we go. You're dead. Well, all right then. Let's see how I'm gonna perform against that other tank because I have to refight Moonlight. Well, here we have Moonlight and he used the LX cannon. So that's gonna be a bit of an issue. So I need to try and dodge as well, like hide behind things, because I'm not the mobile, I can't exactly dodge stuff. Okay, here we go, so, uh, first things first, let's go with a few missiles, kind of, uh, you know, might as well, right? So, here we go, he does have a lo uh, higher lock-on range than I do, so, okay, there, oh, wait, oh, I noticed that, I noticed he had, like, his, uh, his Alex cannon out, so I was like, hey, I, I guess I gotta move out of the way. Okay, hang on, I'm currently not in the lead, but oh, God. Okay, I was slowly catching up to him, and then he suddenly just drills out his Alex cannon, and then that's pretty much game over for me at that point. Oh, my God. Oh, the, the Alex cannon, not a fan. Not a fan of the Alex cannon at all, especially when I'm a tank. Okay, look, missiles are nice and all, but clearly I do need some power weapons here. 
So let's just uh, focus on that and make sure that I don't get hit by the, by the LX cannon. So that will be... Oh, I dodged that one. I actually dodged that one. And I'm still dodging stuff. I'm still not being... Oh, wait. Actually, he's behind that. No, no, no. I see that you had the LX cannon out. I'm not allowing you to use that on me. Oh, God. I need to pay attention to that he... Oh, no, no, no. I saw that you got your LX cannon out and... No! Ah, crap. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. There! Uh, shoot a bit of my Gatling gun as well. There we go. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, okay, okay. I'm in the lead. I am in the lead. Uh, there! Okay, okay, okay. Look, I know this is a bit cowardly to fight him, but uh, look, he's... There's no way I am actually going to, uh, freaking, uh, face first against an... Look! I wasn't hit by a single LX can. I still managed to go down to 2400 health. Like, holy hell. All right. Now, the thing with this AC, it's very powerful. And it has a lot of things for a lot of situations with a lot of different kinds of firepowers for a lot of different ranges. However, since I was fortified Moonlight, I was kind of forced to use my back weapon, the laser cannon there. And I, I pretty much rely on that because there was no way I was actually going to be using the other weapons there. But I do want to say that this AC would be able to fight a lot of other ACs or hell, even missions because uh, the variety variety of how you can approach things with this AC is pretty damn nice. Now you do, like, you know, are very freaking slow, like even with the overboost, only 300 kilometers per hour, that's nothing. But I guess if you strip off, like, the laser cannon and the missiles, if you need to stay close for some reason, then, well, you got that as an option to try to, to speed yourself up. But other than that, I think it's a solid AC. Uh, but the, the, the demonstration wasn't exactly that great since I was forced to fight this guy. But anyway, I do hope that you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.